Okay, what's up, guys? Uh, I'm working on uh, the Cobra Kai Season 5 review. I'm almost done with the season as of now, Saturday evening. I will finish the review at, right after I finish watching it. And then I will post it probably later this week because I'm trying to space out my videos. Same thing with the Star Wars channel. I'll probably post a video tonight or tomorrow and then one later in the week. I don't like uh, posting pre-recorded videos, but, you know, if it fits the solution, then I think it will uh, work out well. And, you know, yeah, that's right. But, okay, anyways. Andrew Tate. Uh, okay, I'm kind of late to the party. And a few of these pictures are of his brother. I don't know why I did that, but... Um, I guess I did, but I, okay, anyways, so Andrew Tate, he's for like a fat month probably, maybe a month and a half, this dude was probably like maybe the most famous man in the world for a month, like I mean, everyone was just like, you just couldn't stop hearing about him and like getting, like suggested his videos and shit, like it was bananas bro, like they just would not shut the fuck up about this guy, alright, and based, like, uh, Opinion about him, I'm not gonna lie to you. He, he's pretty funny. I'm not gonna lie. But, like, right, just hear me out. So, well, he's not like speed funny, and that's another video I can get to someday. Making a video about uh, speed, actual speed. He's, he's really funny, but yeah. Uh, Tate, so, he is, honestly, man, he's kind of like, um, like a Walmart Dwayne Johnson. Like, one gives good advice, one gives some good advice, and just horrendous advice. One's like, uh, fucking like, well, I mean, one's an amazing actor, uh, was an athlete, and then the other was, uh, I mean, he just fucking, like, scans people on the internet. So, you know, uh, I'm, I'm gonna take the rock hot take, but yeah. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, he's, I mean, he's just posts, like, these, uh, fucking motivational videos, kind of, like, hype videos. I, I don't know, because, the way I see it is he, like, his takes are either basic comments like, you should work hard, men should work hard, uh, fucking, um, try to feed your family, family's important, shit like that, like, basic common sense, and then I'll just say some, like, dumbass, stupid, random shit, like, women, honestly, you're my property, I own you, like, the fuck, I'm like, bro, what? Like, he's just saying this out loud, and then when... I'll get to him getting canceled later, but, like, he's just saying, like, the most, like, banana shit ever, and then, like, just is surprised when the repercussions come to him, like, okay, I don't even know, um, but yeah, he's, he's something else, like, he says basic common sense to lure people in, and then they're like, okay, whatever, I'll do one month of this fucking, uh, um, Top G shit, whatever the, the website is, and then they sign up for it, and then they realize, um, then he literally, when they actually do it, what they do in the, uh, class is tell you to promote his videos. So he, you're paying him to give him more money. As a businessman, I can respect that, but, like, it kind of reminds me of, you know, remember Bella Thorne? When she, um, had started, like, her OnlyFans? And just posted pictures, like, that she posts on Instagram. And, like, scammed everybody. Like, okay, I get it. People chose to do this and you're making money off of it. And, but, like, dude, come on. You know you're taking advantage of people. Like, it's just kind of, like, a horrible thing to do. Like, for real. Like, people really just... Some of these people have, like, no morals when it comes to making business. It's just kind of, it's kind of sad. But, uh, anyways, that's not really the point. Um, yeah. So, pretty much... He's, like, and he's really hated by, he was really hated by a lot of people, especially girls. Like, bro, if you posted something on, like, IG or some shit saying, I hate Andrew Tate or I don't like Andrew Tate, then, like, <laughs> girls would just be munching on me, bro, trust me. Anyways, um, so, yeah, he's, he's funny. His fans are pretty, like, that people who actually like him. Are actually fucking stupid, bro. <laughs> like, those dudes are, like, actual dumbass. Like, they actually believe the thing he says. Like, I, w I want to see, like, one person who's listened to his advice became successful off of this, like, platform or whatever. But, uh, anyway. So, yeah, he's just getting got more and more famous. And then, uh, to the point where he got, uh, banned off of, like, literally fucking everything.
because of like all the sexist shit he said. And like, I, usually I think cancel culture is bad, except for when it's like you know, like Bill Cosby or some shit. You know what I mean? Like R. Kelly, like someone who does something really, really bad. But like, in cases like this where someone says something offensive and they just keep doing it and they don't apologize until there's re- until after repercussions, I feel like that's fair because like I mean, dude, it's not like. People call him misogynistic, and he just kept going, bro. It's just like, bro, you're you're literally just like digging your own hole here, like. But, anyways, uh, yeah, he really, um, was controversial for a reason. He he was not, you know, super nice dude. Right before he uh, got banned from like everything and got shadow banned to the dark realm with Jimbo. But uh, he, before that happened, he was going to fight uh, Logan Paul or Jake Paul. And Logan's like, oh, I promise you, you're going to lose to one of them. And honestly, man, I feel like it's really, I hate to say it, but I feel like they, one of them, probably Jake would probably be him, to be honest. Because, I mean, bro, he literally just smokes cigars all day and, like, fucking, like, bitches about, like, wolf people and shit. Like, that's, that's basically what he spends his days doing. And like, like fucking recording things for Twitch. Like, I mean, is he rapping shit? Yeah, but like, dude, you're not like being physically fit and being fit for like boxing or like a combat sport is like different. Like, I mean, I know he's to practice, but that's not like the same practicing like they're doing. I mean, it's probably definitely gonna kick their asses, but but um, yeah, he's pretty old now, and uh, I mean, he's probably just trying to make money. And if he lost, it'd be like over for him. But yeah, if I had it my way, I hope he'd beat. Jake Paul, because I really don't like him, and then he'd get his ass kicked by Logan Paul, because I like Logan more than him, but yeah, uh, yeah, that's not gonna happen, because, uh, he kept, uh, being, uh, saying the sexist shit, and then got banned, and then they couldn't do a fight, and then Logan's just like, uh, well, I'm not gonna give you a platform to, uh, spread, you know, all your messed up messages, which, um, some people said, oh, he's scared, but I'm just like, I feel like that's just, like, the reasonable, logical, responsible thing to do. Like, if someone's saying shit that you think's messed up, why would you give them a way to make more money and become more famous instead of, you know, just letting them die out and um, blaze a fire? Like, their career die in a blaze of fire. I mean, like, like, that's just, that's pretty stupid if he took the fight, and I feel like that's pretty mature. But, um, yeah, I mean... Tell me what you guys think, uh, you know? I feel like, for once, Kane's Crush was kind of right about him. But also, I mean, he's pretty funny. And, um, I don't know, it was, it's always funny to see his videos on Instagram. And I don't anymore, but that's, uh, about it. Channels have been popping lately. Uh, thank you for 30 subs on this channel. And, uh, posts on the Star Wars channel. And another post this week coming on Cobra Kai Season 5. And, uh, I'll see you guys later. Thank you.